So many of you wrote us after we told you about the checkout worker at Walmart who just loves to make people happy singing country songs. And by the way, her husband is a coal miner. But every now and then, the universe decides to create a smile, and the grand old Opry was watching. So ABC's Steve Osinsami tells us what happened just this weekend. There's something incredibly powerful about a dream, and for Kayla Sloan, hers came to life here under the bright lights with thousands of people on their feet. It made me realize that this is what I could do for the rest of my life. This is your superpower? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm proud to be a coal miner's daughter. We first met Kayla singing her heart out behind the checkout line at a Walmart in coal mining country. One of her customers recorded this video. My coat of many colors that my mama made for me. Which spread far and wide on the internet and then on this very program. I'm hoping to be on the Grand Ole Opry. <laughs> well, the folks who run the Opry were watching the news that night Here, and decided me. to pluck her star out of the sky, inviting her to sing. <laughs> we're about putting smiles on people's faces and making dreams come true. The night before, she worked at that Walmart in West Virginia, and her husband, a coal miner, had to work too. <laughs> As she was getting ready, a big surprise. Hi, Kayla. Hi, Loretta. Loretta Lynn was calling to wish her well. How have you been doing? I'm doing better now. Well, I love you, honey. I love you too, Loretta. And after one short practice, I a box of Someone gave us. it was showtime. Good? Yeah. Got this? <laughs> I got this. Just watch this video. I think and the moment began with her story. Tonight, that stage is the checkout aisle of a Walmart in West Virginia. Would you give a great grand old Opry welcome to Kayla Sloan? brings us back to this glorious moment. Thank you. A standing ovation for the coal miner's wife singing the coal miner's daughter. That's the music that I grew up listening to and that's what I want to sing. I can never give up now. That's what's going to happen for me. Steve Osinsami, ABC News, Nashville.